On this edition of River Tales, we'll visit with artists at Southeast Missouri State, tour the Tiger Sanctuary at Crown Ridge, see the new exhibits at the Cape River Heritage Museum, and visit an iconic music store in Cape Girardeau. Stay tuned to River Tales. Open Serena was the name given to a special one-night exhibition of student artwork that included painting, metal shop, wood shop, and mixed media studio at the Serena Gallery on the campus at Southeast Missouri State University. The unique blend of arts and crafts made for an interesting experience for all visitors. Open Serena, it's an uh, event put on by students here at Southeast. Uh, it's just a night of, of art uh, that's out of the ordinary, non-traditional, bizarre. It's really, really interesting stuff. Uh, I feel like it was primarily for, um, I felt like it was more for sculpture students and uh, kind of we do more work with space than we do image and things like that. So I feel like we actually got to use the entire building in a way that we wanted to. We could like use whatever kind of sculptural thing that we've been working on or wanted to work on. Uh, we could use this space to do that. It's, it's like a shop. I mean, it has a wood shop and a metal shop. It has a painting studio. It's it really doesn't have any gallery space. I mean, it has like a, uh, has, you know, a small section to show work in, but it's more free roaming. It's, it's just, it's, I don't know, it's more of like an industrial building. It's not really meant to be used as a gallery. Anything from performances to, you know, just your, your basic paintings to sculpture to installations. Um, to even even music uh, and uh, dancing, we try to incorporate. Not only do we have just arts, you know, the fine arts, uh, visual arts students here, we also bring in um, English. Um, we bring in uh, music people out of the uh, music department and dancing department. Just try to really incorporate everybody and just make it really interesting collab of different things. We kind of lined the hallways with paintings and uh, just kind of randomly put pedestals and showed a smaller sculpture there. We did installations in rooms that we felt could work for an installation. We actually had uh, down in the metal shop, we had this very large performance piece that included uh, our teacher our teacher's uh, sculptures as kind of an installation. We set everything up, leaded everyone down there at the end of the night, and uh, kind of did this performance and created a whole atmosphere that you would normally get in any other kind of place. You're gonna be surprised, you're gonna be interested. You're gonna see some humorous things. Um, lots of different emotions you get from this. Um, you know, because like I said, it's it's bizarre, it's off the wall, it's it's everything. We can put paintings on the wall over at, at River Campus, but we never really have a space to do to do uh, these other things we, we want to do. So we figured, why not do it here? Really, the difference between art and uh, Serena building, as opposed to art in a normal gallery, is it's kind of put together all the last minute. I mean, there's a little bit of planning. It's not your your white wall gallery. It's not, it doesn't have dedicated spaces to view art. It's, it's a building walk and you walk through classrooms, you walk through studios, but we transform the space into something that make the space work for the art. Really, Open Serena has been a couple years now. Um, we try to do it at least once a year. Um, and, and, and we like to do it more often if, if if we can get it together. We have to be even more creative in showing and presenting work or creating things. Um, just kind of like 
any kind of performance or installation. So it ends up being kind of experimental, I guess, instead of planned out. It's really, it's very highly collaborative. Um, most of the art in it's not, most of the art in it's not really made beforehand. It's more like, oh, we have this show to put on, so let's make art specifically for it. So yes, it's highly performance based. We try to we try to collab because it's really our opportunity to really it's a great opportunity to get your classmates and really um, come together and get get closer with your classmates and, and work in ways they do, you know, and share ideas and then come up with something um, that and come up with something together on campus. Serena really isn't isn't noticed for what it is. Um, it's, a, it's a building here in the main campus that, uh, yeah, of course, art happens over at River Campus, but we have plenty of art here on main campus. And we just want to let people on the campus know that we're here, uh, the community know that we're here, and that we, we know how to, how to have fun and and make, make awesome art.